right wing outfits have demanded a ban on azan through loudspeakers raj thakre has asked his followers to simultaneously recite hanuman chalisa over loudspeakers so what does the law say about this the noise pollution rules 2000 deal with noise pollution as per the law nobody can use a loudspeaker except under written permission from the competent authority and the competent authority is usually the district magistrate the police commissioner and definitely no officer no, below the rank of a deputy superintendent of police the ideal noise pollution levels should be around 75 decibels according to the rules and under no circumstances 10 decibels more than that 85 decibels that is are there any exceptions to the rule yes there are exceptions to the rule um, you know at least 15 days in a year the state government can uh, say we have this specific functions and uh, therefore we want to uh, blare loudspeakers beyond 10 o'clock of course they have to stick to the decibel levels but they can uh, get authorization for at least 15 days in a year to uh, uh, use loudspeakers beyond 10 pm state actually has to state governments have to specify these 15 days much in advance to be notified in advance adv- uh, identified in advance for the citizens to know which days this is permissible uh, rules also mandate the state governments to categorize areas into industrial commercial residential or silent zones for implementing noise standards who can you complain to you can actually complain to the same authority which sanctioned the use of the loudspeaker that is the district magistrate the uh, commissioner of police and any other officer not below the rank of a deputy superintendent who is authorized to allow for such use what actions can be taken so under the law the police uh, and the district magistrate can take a number of measures they can seize the instrument the loudspeaker can be uh, taken away or they can reduce the volume uh, to bring it within tolerable limits or they can disallow permission for the next one the next function the uh, law gives him a range of uh, punishments and they can also be fined the fine amounts the cpcb has said that uh, should be increased and there is a uh, a lot of talk going on about increasing the fines but so far they have not been increased what are the noise standards in different zones seen in an industrial area it can be in the daytime it has to be around 75 decibels and in the night time it has to be 70 decibels uh, decibels in uh, a commercial area uh, it's 65 in the uh, daytime and 55 in the night time and in residential areas it has to be 55 decibels in the daytime and 45 in the night time and in a silent zone 50 decibels uh, decibels in the daytime and 40 in the night time so day means 6 to 10 and night means 10 to 6 10 pm to 6 am what is a silence zone this is an area which is uh, not more than 100 meters around the institutions like uh, hospitals schools courts religious places and any other area that the uh, state government is free to declare how are the noise levels monitored The noise levels are monitored by the state uh, pollution control board this this data is compiled by the central pollution control board they have a uh, noise pollution monitoring stations in every big city of the country and these have shown that the uh, noise pollution levels are at an all time alarming high almost double the permissible levels in most big cities and it's a health hazard both for uh, uh, physical health and mental health of citizens What is the ideal noise level? The ideal uh, noise level is uh, described in the pollution uh, rules as 75 decibels and maximum it can go beyond 75 is another 10 decibels so maximum is 85 uh, decibels anything beyond that uh, is actually uncomfortable to the human ear and it causes a lot of uh, problems and therefore is not allowed What are the fines for the violation of noise pollution rules The CPCB has in a, a case uh, going on in the NGT suggested that these fines be around 10000 uh, uh, per uh, case but uh, this increase is yet to come into force but uh, the authorities are permitted to bring the noise levels down by requesting whoever is using uh, to reduce the volumes and also to take away the instrument uh, which uh, causes the offense What have the courts said about the use of loudspeakers? 
Yes, given that we are a country which is uh, prone to use loudspeakers whenever we want to and whichever function we have, uh, courts have been asked to uh, rule on this and the Allahabad High Court recently said that there is no fundamental right to use a loudspeaker in any religious function and this would include both uh, Jagran, Azan, uh, the repeated calls for prayer uh, from uh, mosques and any other uh, such functions in the name of religion. So if you are annoyed by loud recitation of anything, the only thing to do in a civil society is to complain to the DM or the commissioner of police or the competent authority. They will bring it down to tolerable levels or switch it off. There is no need to indulge in competitive noise pollution.